It's an event in the nursery today. And why is it an event? It's a changing extravaganza. We are going to change five babies on this video. channel and well you guys today we are having a changing extravaganza and that is because I am going to change um, all five of my nest babies well except for Lainey because I don't really have no clothes for Lainey so Lainey is not going to be changed but all of them is going to be changed we have four girls and one boy that is going to be changed in this video but before we do get started, just some friendly reminders. Um, I will be going live tonight, you guys, in hopes that this video goes up today. If the video doesn't go up today, then, well, I would have went live yesterday. <laughs> but I am going to go live tonight, 5.30 for my Cloud Insiders, and 6 o'clock for everyone. And you guys, I hope it is going to be a fun live. I don't know yet what we're going to do, but before tonight, I will have it figured out. And you guys, thank you so much. We are slowly climbing. We are at 766. So we are doing good, but I need another just a subscriber to change that 66. <laughs> Then when we hit those thousand subscribers, you know we're going to be doing that big giveaway. And well, you guys, at the end of April, we're actually going to be buying the dolls for that big giveaway. And you guys are going to get to watch it. So we have that upcoming on the channel. And well, let's see. What else? Um, 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 I think that might be it. Today is just a casual video, you guys. So... I think what we're going to do is we are going to go ahead and dive down close and that way you guys can watch me change all of them and I've already picked out all of their outfits for today because I know I'm going to take a uh, I know I'm going to go live with one of my nest babies tonight. I just haven't figured out which one. So I thought I'd go ahead and change them all. So, and I thought it'd be fun to take you guys with me and let's see how long it takes for me to change all of these babies. <laughs> so let's get started. So the first one up to be changed is Penelope. And let me stand up. Because one thing I want to do with each one is try not to get the shadow. So anyway, this is Penelope. Um, you guys probably see her better laying down. So let me go ahead and lay her down to be changed. Um, she is my Levi. And... Let me see, you guys, if that helps any. Um, trying to adjust my lighting. There, maybe that'll help if it's kind of coming down a little bit more. That I can go ahead and bring her up close and show her face. Um, I've already do that with each one. So, here's Penelope. And I think with Penelope, I have got several different outfits here picked out. I think with Penelope, I'm going to go ahead and change her. And I'm not changing her diaper um, just because she, it wasn't that long ago I changed her diaper. But the other babies will probably be getting diaper changes. But I'm going to go ahead and put her in this little long-sleeved white um, little t-shirt that's got little blue and yellow and green and pink flowers on it. And I thought that would be really cute for her. Um, like I said, I haven't decided which one's going to be, um, going live with me tonight, but for anybody that doesn't know, because we do have some new subscribers, Penelope is, um, from Etsy, and I believe the shop that I bought her from is called Ivy Reborns, and, um, I bought her about a year ago, and, um, 
She is, of course, like I said, the Levi Scope replica. Um, I'm going to say replica because I know for a fact she's not authentic. So she is definitely my Levi replica. And, um, well, I do honestly just love Penelope. Um, she is weighted. She does not have eyelashes and she's got painted on hair. And um, I just really love Penelope. I love Penelope is one of my, um, if I'm having a bad day, I can put her in my arms kind of babies. Um, do you guys have babies like that? Comment below um, and let me know um, if you guys have got babies like that. It's a little big on um, Penelope. She's a little tiny baby, but I did want to put her in a cute, her cute little um, kitty cat outfit. Isn't that pretty? Yes, she says, isn't I pretty? Yes, you are, my dear. And each of the girls, I did bring a little bows for, because especially when they're bald babies or they've got painted hair, you guys, I do like to keep little bows on them. Um, Penelope especially. Penelope, honestly, I probably could have just made Penelope a boy, because um, she kind of gives me boy vibes, but I really wanted a girl Levi, so... This, that's Penelope, you guys. Let me stand up and make sure she is seen. And first, a baby down. Here she is. Aw. Close-up of her outfit. Okay. Let's move on to baby number two. next baby we are going to change and well faith is the willa replica and and i found that out and i am going to go ahead and wipe her down i did bring my water wipes out just in case i felt like some of the babies need to be wiped down and i feel like um faith here does anyway faith is my willa replica and she um was on amazon and the only reason I know this um, is because she was sent to me by a dear, dear, dear Dolly Angel. Um, and so um, she came from Amazon. But I, that's why I don't really know too much more about her. She was a gift and a sweet gift that she was. And I just love Faith. Faith is actually one of the dolls that I do intend on getting modified. And I, I'm limited on diapers, you guys. So that's why some of them are not getting changed. But <laughs> I am going to refresh baby powder in Faith. Um, kind of put it up here on her just so. Um, it wasn't that long ago I did Penelope like this. So you guys, we're going to go ahead and put a little baby powder on her. And um, so yeah, and Willow, Willa, the Willa replica here. Um, is actually the closest to my granddaughter um, sculpt that I have seen anywhere um, when she was smaller, when she was younger. It, it just, she remind, oh my goodness, what is that? That is, you guys don't panic. That is from my wigs, okay? <laughs> it's one of my um, little nettings that um, came on my wigs and I keep my wig caps um, over there and on the, on some semi the same shelf that I keep the baby clothes so it somehow got mixed in so don't panic it was just a wig cap you guys it wasn't anything scary and yeah you guys we are also joined um, by socks and I know you guys cannot see her behind me but she is literally pushing against my back I don't have a lot of onesies you guys all my babies have got onesies on so I actually need to wash um, their onesies. That's why I'm kind of taking their onesies off and not really putting another one on. They're just going to have to go without their onesies because I do. I need to go ahead and get them washed. Um, 
Actually, I need to start going through and washing all my baby clothes to be completely, utterly honest with you guys. So, today's video, I just thought it would be fun if we just chatted a little bit. Um, I appreciate you guys so very, very much. All of my new subscribers, um, all of you guys for supporting me. Um, I really appreciate you guys, and I know I say that a lot in these videos, but really, um, you know, it's you guys that makes this channel. Um, I just really want to stress that, is it really is you guys that make this channel. Um, it's you guys. And so, that's why I am so very, 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 very appreciative of you. Of you all for everything that you do for me. And so I thought maybe I tried. She's got such a tiny, tiny head that most of my bows do not fit too well on a face. But we try anyway, don't we, sweet girl? Um, and she's about um, a 19 inch doll. She might be a little bit smaller, you guys. She might actually be like a um, 18 or 17, but I think she's supposed to be a 19, but she's a little tiny baby. So she's one of my little littles. She is definitely one of my little little. So here is Faith. Changed. In her cute little outfit. Aw. Yes, isn't she pretty? She says, yes, I'm so pretty, everybody. <laughs> All right. On to the next one. Here we are with River, and River is um, from Etsy. She is, um, Sarah Palmer is her artist, and um, she was a budget baby, so she's um, not one of the exp expensive artist rendered dolls, but she was a lot of fun to get. She's from the UK. And um, she was a lot of fun to open. She came with an ultrasound, you guys. So um, River here was a lot of fun. Um, she is the Anna replica. I believe that's what her listing was, was an Anna replica. And like I said, she is from the UK, um, Sarah Palmer. And River um, is, I consider her one of my very pretty dolls. I have dolls that, to me, they look... Um, kid-like and baby-like and all of that stuff and then I have some of my dolls that are just pretty dolls I am gonna go and change River's diaper just because it's old and dusty and it's been a hot minute <laughs> um, I'm limited on diapers you guys so that's why I'm trying to be kind of sparing on which ones get changed but River definitely is gonna be one that gets changed anyway um, so yeah she is one of my pretty babies um, Lark is another one in my Pippa. Um, I just kind of consider them very pretty. So River does look like a baby to me. I love the way she looks. I, I do. Um, but she's just, like I said, she's more of like a, one of my pretty, pretty babies. <laughs> and so today with River, oh, I figured each doll I would talk something different with you guys. So on this round, let's go ahead and talk about um, Maddie Monday. Um, because this Maddie Monday is hosted by moi. <laughs> yes, you guys. It is I. And the theme that I picked this week. Sorry, I'm also keeping an eye on my camera, you guys. My batteries might die. I might have to change out my batteries. Anyway, the theme that I picked. Oh, I didn't tell you guys. I'm just changing, ain't I? This is a, a white little romper I'm putting on River. It's got the orange and yellow um, flowers and teal blue flowers and a little pink bow and it's just a little onesie romper um, anyway I picked the theme and this theme is picnic with me and mommy and um, you guys can interpret that and do however you want because you know here in the nursery sometimes we do things a little unconventionally <laughs> so um, are you guys curious to see what my picnic is going to involve Yes, you guys, it is going to be 
a fun picnic. Um, I think that the Maddie that I decided to use in um, the video is, um, oh, sweet river, is um, going to be Geo. I think Geo is going to be my buddy on Monday, and she's the one I'm going to do the picnic with. And um, something I wanted to bring up to you guys is you don't. <laughs> I love the floppy River is. She's not really weighted, so she's not heavy, but she is floppy. I will um, say that. Oh, she looks adorable. Anyway, um, so you guys, on the Maddie Mondays, you don't have to have a Maddie. Um, we want to extend it to everybody. So it doesn't matter, even if you don't have a doll named Maddie. Um, just If you just partake in the theme, all we ask is you tag us. And the reason we ask to be tagged, you guys, is um, so we can shout you out. Um, I know that I share every Maddie Monday video I see that I'm tagged in. I share it on my community page. And so that's what we want to do. We want to share you guys' videos. So we ask that you guys just tag us. And um, that's it. Just tag us. Whatever, you know, if you hear a theme and it sounds really good to you guys, then for sure we want you to participate. Maddie or a no Maddie. And this is... I do, I had to kiss her. She does look adorable, doesn't she? Here is my river. And doesn't she look adorable? Of course, like you guys know, everybody in the Cloud Kid Nursery is barefoot. Yes, we are. It's summertime. All right, on to the next baby. <laughs> Here is the next nest baby, and that is a story. And here is story up close. And yeah, you guys, my batteries died. I, I'm sorry about that. But this is also um, me using up old batteries right now, um, because when my camera gets so low, I just pull them. And so I'm going to see if um, if I can go through some of these old batteries I'm storing. Anyway, you guys, um, I also want to talk to you guys about collabs, you guys. Um, I am open to show your guys' babies off in a collab, and I just also wanted to remind you guys of that. And, you know, you guys can just let me know, hey, I, you know, a baby, maybe you want me to change with you. Um, you know, anything. You Give me your idea. And I, it doesn't have to be a channel. It can be not a channel. And um, I do still want to collab with you guys. Um, and I could put it up in my video. Um, and I just wanted to let you guys know that it's been a minute. Oh, you guys. Let me just kind of do this. I'm, I'm not trying to show her, her, her off. So let me do this, you guys. Okay. And I want to show my baby off, you guys. They're like my babies, okay? <laughs> I forgot the story was anatomically correct. I apologize. Um, yeah, story is... Okay, so the story about story. Um, story has been with us since Christmas. And she was a Christmas gift from Pudgy Papa and um, his wife and my granddaughter and I'm just gonna put her in this white onesie with Winnie the Pooh and purple flowers this is um, a onesie that belonged to my granddaughter and um, one of the ones that my daughter sent when she outgrowed it so I figured that would be super cute for story and well story I honestly um, do not know stories sculpt I want to say I really don't know, you guys. If you can comment below what sculpt is story. Um, I really don't know her sculpt, you guys. So if you any of you know what sculpt she is, um, I would love to hear. But she was gotten from Walmart. Um, surprisingly, from Walmart. And we did just go look at that Walmart um, in the past, yesterday's video. And well, I want to say most of the reborns you get from Walmart is probably going to be vinyl. And um, I don't mind vinyl. I actually love vinyl dolls. They are second on my list of favorite dolls. 
um, just due to the fact that you can dress them however. And I love silicones too. Don't get me wrong, I love Harley. She's my only silicone I own. Um, but they're a lot, a little bit more maintenance as far as everything sticks to them and they're easier to tear and damage. And so for me, a vinyl um, doll is almost second in comparison. No, are they as cuddly? No. Do they move around as much? No, um, they don't. But I do like to snuggle with Story um, every now and then. I sure do, um, even though she's vinyl. And she's a lot of fun because like this summer, sorry guys, I know, it looks a little rough, don't it? You know, I want to turn her little head so she don't suffocate. There she goes. Um, but this summer, you know, it's going to be fun because she can, I can maybe do videos of her in a pool and I can get her wet. And I mean, I do got to worry because I don't want water to get in her creases and mold, of course. Um, so I wouldn't, I'm not going to do uh, that probably a lot, but I'm just saying you, if you really wanted to, you could. Um, so that's why, um, story is, I actually do. And, um, I don't mind at all. I really don't mind vinyl dolls at all. I actually want to add more to my collection. Um, so anyway, you guys, that's right about the collab. I just wanted to remind you guys of that, um, that, you know, I am willing to collab with anybody that wants to collab with me. And while well, I put her in this little denim, um, uh, jumpsuit and you guys, this denim jumpsuit is years old. I promise you it has been washed uh, several times over and what bow I guess I brought did I lose her bow huh did I really bring this bow for story well you guys I guess I picked out this bow for story and I don't know why but yeah it would have to be the bow I picked out well we don't know why but I think I thought that the green would go good with the purple maybe and uh, maybe it would go good with the denim I don't know, but Story is going to get her little bow right in the center of her head. Yes, right there. And let's turn her where she can look at you guys. And here is Story. All beautified in her and happy girl. She's such a happy girl. That's why I love whatever this sculpt is. I love it. And Story is actually another one of my dolls that if I really wanted to, she could be a boy. She really could, but she came as a girl, and as soon as I saw her, it was like, yeah, she's a girl. She is definitely a, a girl. <laughs> so, there is a story. Here we are with Joshua and well Joshua is really only my my only little nest baby boy um so really I'm just gonna wipe his head down um he doesn't have nothing else but a cloth body and um, Joshua here is from Etsy and Joshua is also about a year old I think I ordered him um after, before Penelope um I think I ordered him because I wanted a cuddle baby so bad. I watched some YouTube videos on it and I wanted him so bad. And so I want to say I ordered him first before Penelope. So Joshua here is also about a year old and I did get him from Etsy and I want to say he was on sale for maybe like $120, maybe $130, um, something to that effect. Um, so he was, he wasn't expensive. Um, he was a budget baby and, um, I fell in love with cuddle babies because of him. 
it is because of Joshua that I love cuddle babies. He is just a joy to hold and snuggle. And well, I actually think this one here might, I need to take some Instagram pictures of him because cuddle babies are also um, uh, just amazingly um, posable. And this diaper is like, what's your bed for Joshua? Poor Joshua, whoa, boy, boy. Um, anyway, and so, I don't know what his sculpt is. I don't know anything else about him. If you guys recognize this, this pretty little put -um, if you guys recognize this little put -um, um, just comment it below and let me know. But I really don't know what his sculpt is. And this is going to swallow him up. Swallow this boy up. What size is this? It's a zero to three. Is it a zero to three? Or is it a six to three? No, it's a zero to three. Well, we're going to do it. I'm going to go ahead and he's going to be swallowed up in this, you guys. Um, I'm still going to do it, I think. I picked it out. I'm going to do it. I want to put this outfit on one of my babies. And, well, um, it's too small for, like, Gabriel and some of my other boys. <laughs> but it's too big for um, maybe Joshua, but it's just going to have to uh, be for Joshua. Maybe it's not, you guys. Well, maybe a little bit. That's okay. That is A-okay. White Joshua it is A-okay, sweet boy. And well, with cuddle babies, you know, they're kind of, um, some people like them and some people don't, you know, and they do have their downfalls, um, you know, which is, you know, they're all cloth, so, you know, if you, but you can put, like, gloves and stuff, but sometimes... You know, you don't want to necessarily put, like, gloves and stuff onto your babies. You know, so with Joshua, um, it never has bothered me, his little crabby hands. Um, because in the summertime, I don't cover him up. Um, I, I probably will for, like, Instagram pictures. It probably would be a good idea, maybe, to make him look more realer. But um, I, on a normal basis, do not mind Joshua's little crabby hands. I think they're adorable, and I just love love this little baby here. Um, I actually want to get a more cuddle babies, you guys. I want to get a girl cuddle baby so bad. Um, I just, well, maybe this will fit him okay once I get it zipped. Maybe I just was thinking, oh, it fits him okay, don't it, you guys? Joshua is my little Popeye baby because, as you can tell, and yes, I did take his onesie off, you guys, because, like I said, I do want to wash onesies. Um, as you can tell, he is my little Popeye, my little Popeye boy, because he's been eating pinach because him got the muscular arms, muscular arms, Joshua. <laughs> And here's a little hat that's probably way too big for Joshua. But you guys, oh my God. Look at Joshua. Oh, whenever I get him dressed, and he is a joy. He is such a joy to hold and everything, you guys. So I think we are going to end it with this sweet little image of a Joshua. And let me take you guys off the tripod. If you guys like this video, then please go on down there and give us that big thumbs up. We really appreciate it. And well, while you're down there, Joshua says, please do what, Joshua? Subscribe. We really appreciate it, you guys. Guys, um, appreciate every one of you. Yeah, you guys, the Maddies are back there. Um... <laughs> And the Raggedy Ants, just so you guys can see. But um, I just kind of have them covered a little bit for the purpose of this video. And um, anyway, here's River in her little changing. Okay. And here is Faith in her little outfit. And well, like I said, you guys, go ahead and go on down there and subscribe. And well... Hopefully, I get this video up today, so hopefully I see you guys tonight. But if not, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!